Hi there, let's make a folding card and print ready. PAX is built around a PDF format, a universal, secure and self-contained file format. PAX opened a multi-page PDF document without conversion to an intermediate or proprietary file format. It represents several folding card and artworks. It all starts by bringing together the cutting die and artwork. I position the ruler and remove the structural layer that the design agency has used. I continue by importing the structural design that is used in the production environment. All information is imported and also tagged with the PDF processing steps. It's the next evolution and standardization in a packaging production workflow, where software and hardware can interact with the technical information available in the PDF at various stages. For instance, driving cutting tables with a PDF where originally CAD files are used instead. The intuitive and configurable user interface gives access to a multilingual work environment with numerous pre-press editing features. Here, I use one of the selection tools to join the glue flaps and ensure that they are not covered with ink. Different single designs may be combined later in a repetition, in which stations may have common knives, have overstepping bleed and may have their own station number. Defining and storing this information in the 1UP may simplify and automate the creation of a nested step and repeat later on in the workflow. I finish the merge of cat and artwork by defining the folding carton dimensions. If you want to move fast and reduce errors, you may want to know if the artwork content corresponds with the implemented house rules for printing. With a customized pre-flight preset, PAX performs many checks, such as the presence of low-resolution images, barcodes and elements with RGB paint. It results in a pre-flight report or an interactive accessible list in PAX. The errors are automatically corrected by PAX or by the prepress operator. Here, I replace the 10 dpi embedded low-resolution image by an external high-resolution image. I update the recognized EAN barcodes with the correct number and a single paint. I continue with conversion of the RGB images to CMYK. I finally ensure that the black text is in overprint. Printing presses are characterized by using inks ranging from CMYK and spot inks to presses with fixed ink sets or expanded gamuts. I add new ink sets coming from Pantone books or from custom ink books. I may set the ink type and printing method. I can even use the integrated ICC based color management tools to map all spot inks to the expanded gamut of my offset or digital press. I conclude the ink management by setting the correct order. The character recognition solution allows converting text outlines of different languages into live editable text. It makes the difference when you have to meet tight deadlines instead of going back and forth with the customer. The asset palette gives an overview of production critical artwork elements, such as an overview of embedded images or those linked to an external reference on the hard disk. PAX supports Photoshop PSD, TIFF and many other image formats and gives the possibility to make edits in Photoshop and see the result instantly in PAX. Folding cartons with a lovely rich sheen are most likely embellished with varnish. Paxit's wide underprint tool manages primers and finishing inks in a fast and efficient way. I have selected the complex background layer, set the finish separation and request Pax to spread the varnish just a little bit outside the area on which it has to be applied. Let's show it again using images with a drop shadow, in which the transparent and white image pixels are ignored.
Misregistration between printing units on a multicolor press may cause gaps or white spaces on the final printed carton. The Smart Wrapper technology compensates the trouble by overlapping artwork elements in an automatic way. No matter how the trapping has been applied on the file, in other words, in an automatic or interactive way, the operator may still influence the final result by adjusting the Smart Trapper preset or by using the Trapper tool to make modifications. Here, I prefer to have a single ink in the pullback result. No need for boring and routine tasks. Let's take the digital proof and automate the creation process. Packions allow grouping or recording interactive tasks. You can set the individual parameters and play it back on the design or use it as a customized tool. I made a Paction that inserts an information panel and generates individual pages for finishing separations on which the customer has to sign off. The information panel uses the live object technology to link the content to the artwork. At the bottom left, I have an overview of the inks and the consumption, while at the top left, PAX has loaded information from an external data source. Here, I show how PAX obtains order information from an MIS or ERP using the item ID. I can even change the language. The folding carton industry nests and repeats approved artwork on a printing sheet. I import the cutting die coming from the toolmaker and PAX automatically positions according to the gripper, plate and substrate dimensions. Now I can apply the artwork on the placeholders. PAX applies a unique number to every station and waste numbers to control the sharpness of the dies during the finishing process. We need artwork outside the die because the folding cartons are produced full bleed. PAX searches the common knives and oversteps the artwork on invisible flaps. Registration marks and ink strips are added to manage the quality during the printing process. The Live Objects technology is used to make dynamic marks and printing strips. They can even be controlled after they have been applied. An ink strip is easily updated when a last minute change occurs. Because the folding carton is produced double sided, PAX also has the tools to turn and tumble the step and repeat and make a backside out of the front in a wink of an eye. The view options are used to inspect the alignment between both sides. Since the folding cartons are embellished with varnishes, PAX offers export tools to extract finishing inks out of the step and repeat for tool making. I'm at the end of the video presentation. Hybrid Software looks forward to hearing from you. Find out more about us on our corporate website and YouTube channel. Thank you for watching and for now, goodbye.